So normally I start my day off by waking up, but today I really only got like three hours of sleep because I was trying to wait for my YouTube video to load or not load, upload. And while doing that, I found an app called Yubi that has the anime of Yu-Gi-Oh um, dubbed for free. I don't have to pay for anything. I just have to like download the app. So I kind of sort of binge watched some of the series. <laughs> Good morning. It is 11.30? No, it is 10.11. Um, I only got like, so I didn't pull an all-nighter, um, like I said I would, but I only got like three hours of sleep, but I feel amazing, so, yeah, I'm ready to start my day. What am I eyebrow missing? Just missing a whole chunk of my eyebrow whatever so today um when i woke up after my three hour nap i realized my mom did leave a note this time um with my chore list and so i looked at it and then decided to not do them yet because i wanted to eat cereal and i wanted to continue the series and i quickly regretted that decision a little after a while so i just came to the alarming discovery that i wasted three hours of my day watching Yu Gi Oh. <laughs> and I have started none of my chores and I have online virtual class in like three hours. So no Three and a half hours. So this is great <laughs> While attempting to make my bed I accidentally knocked down my curtain rod because it is not bolted into my wall. It is um a tension rod So it's very easy to knock down and I did that So after I finished my chores, I decided to play Animal Crossing instead of watch Yu-Gi-Oh! And while playing I didn't realize um, where this audio came from. So there's a song on YouTube. It's Nicki Minaj X Animal Crossing and it's the Anaconda lyrics over an Animal Crossing song, but I never knew which one it was until today when I made that discovery. Oi toy named Troy used to live in Detroit. Big dope send the money. He was getting them coins. Was a shootout with the law, but he lived in a palace. I don't remember the rest. So these next few clips aren't anything like too, too important or interesting. I'm doing the dishes from when what I ate the other night, um, you know, and my mom's dishes. And then I'm drinking a cup of coffee because I'm hella tired because I'm running on three hours of sleep. And then this is me logging into my class and trying to figure out what to do, even though I don't know how to technology. I'm not that good at it. I then quickly realized I am still in my pajamas and I don't want to be that student that's still in their pajamas while, um, you know, doing a video chat for their class. So I quickly got up and just grabbed the first things I saw in my closet. I didn't grab anything extra or anything, you know, fancy, just regular clothes I would wear to campus. So I had randomly decided to do my makeup because I had like 45 minutes to spare and I didn't feel like just sitting there or just waiting or like getting up or anything. So I decided to do my makeup and I filmed a first part and then I grabbed the wrong eyeshadow brush and put a whole bunch of black in my crease when I was supposed to put red. So I had to restart and then the re I threw that brush because it was dirty and I was like crap I need to clean it later but I don't feel like cleaning it right now because I'm trying to do my face. Fun fact about me, I hate wearing makeup outside of drag. If it's not drag, I refuse to wear makeup. Or if it's not for like a look, like I refuse to wear makeup. I don't wear it day to day. I only wear mascara and eyebrow pencil. That's it. I don't do none of this eyeshadow, none of this liner. I don't do any of that. So this look is very, very, very simple. I only use about two color, no, three colors on the eyeshadow palette. And they're all from the same palette. Um, but I guess I can walk you through it. So basically, I used the NYX Ultimate Palette in the shade Phoenix. I don't know, that's what the back says. The back says Phoenix, so if you want the same palette, it's, it says Phoenix on the back. I don't know. I don't, I don't even look at the crap I'd be using half the time. But I use like this red shade in it. Um, the whole fucking palette's red. Whatever. I use like the bright red shade. <laughs> they don't have names. <laughs> <laughs> I put that all around my crease and um, I just blend it out so that it doesn't have like hard lines. So then after that I do um, a cut crease which basically means I put um, like concealer on my crease and I'm basically cutting into the shadow. 
Um, the reason I look a little weird is because I do this trick where you put it on your eyelash line, you look up, and then it stamps where your crease starts and ends. So then, like, you just follow that. I go a little bit above it, though, um, because then it kind of can sometimes smear. So, yeah. So when I'm done cutting the crease, I don't set it. I leave it tacky so that I can put um, this, like, shimmer kind of metallic shadow over it. Um, it looks really pretty on my eyes, so that's why I always put it. Um, I do like a goldish kind of in the center, and then I do like a like a more silver, shinier one in the corner of my eyes. Um, still using the same palette from NYX, the Phoenix palette, so. Um, if you do like this look, um, you can go get it. So I was originally just going to leave the eyeshadow alone and just leave it at that with my eyebrows, but um, I felt like being extra, so I put on some liquid liner. Um, I do a very thin liner. In Even in drag, I don't like a lot of eyeliner. I like a simple amount of eyeliner. And so the same carries over for out of drag. I literally do just a line. Like, you can't even tell I'm wearing eyeliner 50% of the time. Not even 50. Like, 90% of the time. You can't tell I'm wearing eyeliner. I don't know. I just, I like the more simple look out of drag. So, like, that's why. So in this moment, someone joined the video call and was playing really awful music. I don't know what it was, but it sounded bad. I didn't like it, and I was like, um, rude. It's called mute your mic. It's what everyone else is doing. I don't know. I hate when people don't mute their mic. It's so annoying. So I don't know of anyone that does this other than drag queens when they're gluing down their eyebrows, but when I put on mascara um, to put on false lashes, I have to like comb through the mascara on my lashes to make sure that my lashes are separated and clump free because I hate like having to clean lashes um, because of mascara. So yeah, that's what I was doing. Then of course I put on lashes. Then this moment that all the other students started joining in the video chat. So class started at four. That's when everyone was supposed to be in the video chat by. But I thought everyone was going to be joining in like five minutes before, like five to ten minutes before. No. Bitches were joining 20 to 15 minutes before, and I was still doing my makeup. And so I'm over here panicking because I'm like, oh crap, can my classmates see that I'm putting on lashes right now? And so I'm like, fuck, 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 fuck. So I'm like trying to rush my makeup because then I'm like, fuck, when the professor comes to the video chat, like, I gotta be done. Like, I'm thinking the professor is coming any minute to the video chat, so I'm like, crap, 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 I gotta go. So I finished up my makeup by doing the last steps, which are a um, like a lip balm so that my lips aren't my lips aren't chopped, and then I do my lipstick. Um, I just go for something simple. This lipstick is like literally my lip my lip shade, like it's the same color as my lips. It's freaky. So I put that on, and then I'm ready to join my classmates. <sighs> so basically, once I finished my face, I joined the group chat. Finally, I unmuted my mic. I un did the no video feature on the, my camera and decided to join the class. Um, these are just some of my classmates. Um, I blurred out this one portion because uh, this girl's name was up there instead of her face. So I was like, um, let me not dox her and put her on YouTube because uh, that's rude. <laughs> yeah. And then my professor is here and then there's me um, looking at my makeup through my phone instead of paying attention in class. Okay, so funny story. This random dude joins our video classroom, and no one knows who he is because we're, it's like a class of 20, so we all know each other. So one of my classmates messages in our class group chat that even our professor is in, hey, who are you? And so I'm laughing at my table, or I'm laughing at my laptop because I know this chick, and she is <laughs> it's just so funny that she did that. And then later, our professor sends a message in the group chat saying, he is one of my students from a different class. He joined the wrong group chat. And I'm just sitting there like laughing my ass off. I have to mute my microphone and I have to turn off my video camera because it is so hilarious to me that my professor responded in the middle of class. Oh yeah, and then I got hungry so I made a peanut butter sandwich because um, I didn't feel like cooking today. And so this is a video of me taking off my lipstick because it felt gross and I didn't feel like getting lipstick on everything. So I just recorded an entire explanation except I didn't hit the record button. So... I have to restate all of what I just said. Anyways, I decided to get in drag today because I'm home alone and I've got nothing better to do. So I take a glue stick and start gluing down my eyebrows. Um, this method that I'm using is actually the best method. I just am lazy and never do it. Um, but today I had all the time in the world because it was like seven o'clock at night.
basically the method is you run a shit ton of glue in your eyebrow and then you take your eyebrow spoolie and you brush the hair up and flat so that the hair lays flat. Like my makeup looked amazing at the end and I could do like tight zoom in with my eyes and you couldn't see my eyebrows because they were so well like hidden because I actually did this method. So your eyebrows have to be done in multiple layers um, depending on the thickness of your eyebrow. My eyebrows are kind of thick, so I have to do multiple layers. Um, so while I'm letting the glue dry, um, I'm putting on foundation. Uh, neither of these foundations are my shade, but when I mix them, they look close enough. So that's basically what I'm doing. So after I did my foundation, I put a final layer of um, glue stick on my eyebrows, and I set them with setting powder. This is basically just so that um, my eyebrows uh, don't move and stay in place. Some drag queens don't set their eyebrows, they just let the glue get hard as a rock. I've never done that and I didn't feel like starting to do that so yeah. But they also use stick foundation which is very different than liquid foundation so I kind of needed the um you know the setting powder so that my eyebrows wouldn't lift. After I finish setting my eyebrows and I dust off the excess powder I put foundation over them so that I can like fully block them out. And then that's when the real transformation really starts in this. So the first thing I do is map out where my eyebrows are going to be. Um, so you can't really see what I'm doing in this step. But basically, my foundation is still wet. So it, like, when you press on it with pigment or with any, like, powder, it sticks to it, like, really well. So I'm basically stamping the shape of eyebrow that I kind of want to do. Um, and so I stamp it on one side and I stamp it on the other side. I've never done this method. I don't know where I got this idea, but I tried it out. I didn't come out too bad. I mean, it came out crooked, but I always have crooked eyebrows, so it's new. But my eyebrows look really good. Um, so right now, I'm just doing my contour and concealer. Um, there's no really special thing that I do. I kind of do the standard drag queen like contour. However, once I'm done blending and everything, I do cut my cheek in a very particular way. So I go right behind the contour and like basically this little bump on my ear is where I start cutting it and then I bring it all the way around and I want a very like circle cheek. I don't know why. I really like the way it looks. Um, a drag queen that does this is um, Thorgy Thor. That's how her contour is and I love it. So I guess that's why I do it. I'm going straight into the eyes. So I'm taking the same palette. Um, blending with the red, the bright red that I'm using, and then I dip into another palette and I get this neon orange and I blend that out on the sides. And then um, later on I use a like a white concealer to cut my crease and then I set it with the bright white eyeshadow. Well, it's not an eyeshadow, it's a face powder. But like no one is sparkling white other than like Edward from Twilight. So for me it's an eyeshadow. Okay, the bitch needs eyebrows. So what I do is I take my um, eyebrow cream and I start filling in where I had sketched out. So this next clip is just me struggling to get them to look the same. Um, you know, whatever. My eyebrows are never the same, so what's new? Um, my phone actually, so I hit stop recording by accident. So my phone didn't get me um, uh, putting, like, putting an eyeliner on, but I'm not wearing a lot, so... It, you don't really miss anything. So this is just me putting on my other lash, um, doing finishing touches like my lipstick, my lip gloss, and um, stuff like that. Uh, but yeah. Okay, so I haven't really posted the photos yet. I'm probably going to post them next week because I'm trying to stockpile on looks um, for reasons. But yeah, she's cute. I really had a good time filming and editing and stuff. I just finished photo shoot um i don't feel like taking this off yet but i need to start editing the video so i'm gonna start editing while in drag and i'm gonna be doing my voiceovers probably in drag too because i need to get this shit done and correct i was i'm still editing and still doing voiceover in drag but i'm almost done so once i'm done this shit's coming off so that's gonna wrap up today's vlog um i want to take this off right now on camera but I'm really tired. I'll take it off later. I'll make it into tomorrow's vlog because I'm probably going to do it at like 1 in the morning. Um, but yeah, that's it for today. I, yeah.
Good night.